everyone, welcome back to Purple Monkey TCG. I'm your host, Leah, and today we are going to get back into the Oko Planeswalker deck there. It is from the Throne of Elderon. Don't forget, like, subscribe, and get your notifications going. Keep in mind, this is part two of two. So if you haven't seen part one and you would like to see us the, doing the unboxing, please go back and view that one as well. So today, like I said, we're going to just get into the deck. Um, we had our Oko card. We went over that in the last video, but really strong Planeswalker, um, able to negate damage to himself and creatures. Also, he's able to, um, for seven points, he is able to actually add 10, 10 counters onto all of your creatures as the base, the base of it. Okay. So he's also got a plus one that you can add two one one counters onto a single creature card. So like if you've got one you've already built up with four of those counters on it, well now it becomes a 14-14 because of the 10-10. So definitely if you can get that built, very, very powerful card. Um, so like I said, we're gonna get into the deck. So I'm gonna get this open. Plastic off of here. Okay. okay, so you guys see something different that you haven't seen before. I am for my magic decks. I am buying Ultra Pros. I found a way to buy them in bulk, and I hope one day when I get the web store up and running to be able to sell them to you guys. Um, but what I do is I take, say, like this one is blue and green, so it's water and light. Take half and half and just randomly insert them. I don't insert them into the sleeve by color because then someone might catch on to that and think, okay, well, they got all green cards left, so they've only got green cards. Well, when you randomly mix them, like I'll take all those out and I'll just kind of like shuffle them together and then just start inserting. And then I've got the protected cards. Now, I wish Pokemon started using these boxes. Hey, Pokemon Company US, let's uh, make some bigger boxes, huh? This way we can sleeve our card and put them back in the respectable boxes, please. But anyways, so we're going to go through this today. Um, here's our rares. We've got Wildborn Preserver, Return of Wild Speaker, so that's a Garouk card. Obviously not Garouk, but featuring Garouk in the image. So that's cool. Oko's Hospitality. Got two of those. The Fairy Vandal. Oh, that's uncommon. So we only had a handful of rares in this deck. So here is our other cards, our uncommons and stuff. So I have never seen one like this. Look at this. So we have the Beanstalk Giant. And then we have a sorcery spell with it. So it's a creature with a spell. Fertil Fertile Footsteps. Sorcery Adventure. Search your library for a basic land card. Put it onto the battlefield. Then shuffle your library. So since this has a mana cost, you can use this as many times as you want. We've also got stars. So Beanstalk Giants, power and toughness are each equal to the number of lands you control. So if you can get a bunch of land on there, that could be a very, very nice card. You see, we've got more. So this is an adventure instant. So those are cool. I've never seen ones like that before. And this deck seems to be quite full of them. So definitely, definitely a nice deck. Thornwood Falls. And then we got our islands, our forests, our spells and enchantments. 
Charm Sleep, Frogify, and then we got this. What is this? After an adventure resolves, you can place the exiled card here. You may cast the creature from exile. So, this might be something I'm going to have to look into on how to use on these adventure cards. So, which that happens every time you get something new, you don't know how to play it. Um, so I'll have to refresh myself on the rules, which, like I told you before, I'm just now getting back into magic. Um, I'm going to be trying to make it to my local retailer so I can do Friday Night Magic, which I hope to be able to record some for you guys. Um, the store I go to, I'm good friends with the owner, so possibly. I haven't spoken to him about it yet. So fingers crossed we can get some Friday night game magic going. Um, but until then, I will see you guys next time. This is Purple Monkey TCG. I am Leah, and I will see you later.